three signs that your manifestation is probably closer than you might actually think because your manifestation is probably right around the corner but these signs are so powerful and so positive that you start to actually doubt that your manifestation is coming not realizing that these signs are trying to tell you that the manifestation is already here now because these signs are so powerful and so positive that your mind starts to doubt and self-sabotage telling you why maybe the manifestation is not going to come or that thought of you thinking that it's not going to come is actually not allowing it to come when it was already coming before you had that thought. So if you're new to this channel, consider hitting that subscribe button and that notification bell because I post a new video every single day. Also, if you want to work with me one-on-one -on -one and become a private client, then consider applying for a free consultation by hitting the website that's in the description box of this video. So the first sign that your manifestation is probably closer than you might actually think is you are always feeling peaceful and happy and just overall on a high vibration state because I know that I feel this a lot. I'm so peaceful and I'm so calm. I can literally just be sitting down looking at the tapestry on my wall that you see behind me, just sitting there. I know it sounds silly, but I just sit there and I look at the tapestry and I feel so present to the moment, just being here now. And then I'm worried, I'm like, am I feeling too peaceful right now? Like, is my manifestation gonna come? But that's the thing is that me feeling peaceful from my perspective means that the manifestation is actually coming. Have I manifested everything that I want? Not necessarily, but do I understand that feeling peaceful and having that sense of inner peace and high vibration is what leads to my manifestation coming? Absolutely, because if I'm sitting there angry, if I'm sitting there in resistance, if you're resisting the present moment, not allowing the moment to be as it is, you're not gonna be able to shift into the reality that you want. So I know that it's about having the vision and feeling the vibration of what you want now, but here's the question is anger or fear or anxiety or worry or reactivity or depression the feeling of your manifestation or is it a feeling that you want to have in general do you want any of those feelings of course not so if you're feeling peaceful if you're feeling calm if you're enjoying the moment as it is and you know your manifestation is just coming either way because you know it exists now you don't have any doubt. Maybe all these crazy things are happening outside of you. Maybe all these things are happening. Maybe this is going wrong, that's going wrong. You're losing your job, you lose a relationship. This happens, but then through all of this chaos of like letting go all these crazy things that are happening because of your spiritual awakening, you still feel peaceful and you know it's coming. And because you feel peaceful and you know it's coming, you're thinking, am I going crazy right now? Because I feel so peaceful, but I should be feeling angry. That's a sign your manifestation is actually coming because you're not crazy. You're learning how to not allow the external circumstances to define your internal state. So you're not allowing the external things to define how you actually feel internally, realizing that the external is a reflection of the internal. So if you feel peaceful, if you feel calm, if you already feel rich in your being, if you already feel rich just being present to the moment because rich has nothing to do with the money in your bank account, but more to do with the feeling that you have, then you know your manifestation is actually on the way. So the second sign is that you don't care about the when or the how. You're just leaving it up to the universe. You trust in the divine guidance. You trust that the universe in your higher self, if you want to call it that, will lead you to the thing that you actually want to manifest. You're not worried about the when or the how. And you might be thinking like, oh my gosh, is this logical? Maybe people around you are telling you that it's illogical to not worry about the when or the how and that you have to figure it all out in this logical, rational way. If you're starting to have this intuitive nudge from the universe almost, that you don't have to worry about the when or the how. You just have to stay present to the moment and follow the divine guidance that you have, have already been receiving, then you know that your manifestation is closer than you might think. Because the when or the how is not up to you. You just have to focus on the end result as if it's already done. Tune into that feeling and vibration. You're not really creating anything. You're tuning into the vibration and the feeling as if it's already done. And you just have to let the universe do the rest. You technically are the universe 
but the awareness and consciousness within you is so powerful and so intelligent and has so many infinite possibilities that it interconnects with the entire universe and literally somehow will create some coincidence coincidence that brings you to exactly what it is that you need in that moment. Okay, there are no coincidences. And if you know that, you know your manifestation's coming. You don't have to worry about the when, you don't have to worry about the how, because you've already seen how the universe works. You've already been seeing maybe some synchronicities, some coincidences. You already know that there's no coincidence. So at the back of your mind, you're like, why do I have to worry? I know that I'm protected. And so if you feel doubt, if you feel worry, then you don't fully trust the universe and you don't trust the when or the how. You have to realize that it's not up to you. It's not up to your ego. You just have to focus on the end result. Ask and you will receive it. But ask in the present tense. That's what true prayer is. In the present tense, as if it's already done now. Comment down below. My manifestation is already here now. Comment down below. My manifestation is already here now. Have I manifested everything that I want? Not yet. But do I know my manifestation's already here now? Yes, I do. When I'm recording this video, I already know my manifestation is here now. Maybe it's illogical, maybe it's not rational, but I feel the vibration of what I want. The vibration of more subscribers and the vibration of more money in my bank account can't match the feeling that I get when I'm recording this video now. Me recording this video now puts me into such a high vibe state that I can't possibly articulate, like I can't use words to explain this feeling that I get when I record videos. It's almost like I connect with the camera and I get into this oneness where the entire room, like colors become more vibrant. I feel more present to the moment. The whole, my whole peripheral vision starts to change. I feel like I'm vibrating on the frequency of abundance for lack of a better term. And I just feel such a high vibration that I know my manifestation is coming and that the how or the when is not necessary in that vibrational state of consciousness. You don't need to worry about that. You don't need to worry about the when or the how. You already know that it's done. Comment down below, my manifestation is already done or my manifestation is already here now. So the third sign is that you feel grateful for your manifestation because you know it's already here. You know that it doesn't exist in the future. You know that your manifestation already exists now so you can literally feel gratitude in your body because you know you're being guided to exactly what you have to create. You already know that. So you can feel grateful for the fact that you know it's already here, even though maybe it hasn't materialized yet. You have such a deep intuition and knowing based on your experiences that you know it's already coming here now. You know that it's already here now and that you don't have to worry about the when or the how. And you just start to feel gratitude for that manifestation as if you already had it and may seem illogical, but manifestation is not a logical process a lot of the times. It's an emotional process where you're learning how to tune into the vibration and the frequency of what you want. And part of that involves being more present to the moment, connecting to who you actually are, and just not worrying about when it's going to come because you have that faith. You have that faith and you know that it's just coming. That's how I feel right now. I haven't manifested everything that I want, but I have this strong faith and knowing that it will all work out. I dropped out of school five months ago to follow what I want to do, and I have this faith and this knowing that what I want is already here now. I was able to make bold moves in my life because I know that I am being guided to exactly what I have to create. And if you're feeling that way, then you know your manifestation is closer than you might think. You're already feeling gratitude, even though you don't even have it yet. Your manifestation is closer than you might think. So that's what I have for you today. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button so more people can see this video and understand that their manifestation is actually closer than they might actually think. So make sure you hit that like button. Also, I wanted to announce that I have a free guided meditation that's specifically designed to help you connect deeper to the present moment. 
So if you want to try it out, it's completely free. All you have to do is hit the link that's in the description box of this video. I'll also leave it as a comment in this video. It's totally free and it's specifically designed to help you connect deeper to the present moment. So that's all I have for you today. Have yourself a great day and see you in the next video.